South Korea's daily COVID-19 cases are back above 100 today, up 26 from yesterday to a total of 110. Some of those are part of a large outbreak at a nursing home in Busan. It seems the rise in cases is connected to all the travel people have been doing this month for the holidays. Lee kyung has the latest. South Korea reported 110 new COVID-19 cases on Thursday. In the past two weeks, the daily numbers have been hovering around the 100 mark. And Thursday's tally puts the figure into triple digits for the third time this month. The recent spike comes from a series of cluster infections, including a major one in the country's second largest city of Busan. At a nursing home in the city, 53 cases have been confirmed after some 260 related people were tested for the virus. With nursing homes once again emerging as a COVID-19 hotspot, health authorities are responding with aggressive measures. We will conduct a special inspection on all nursing homes in the Busan area. We'll complete inspections and social distancing measures, the wearing of masks and entry logs at these facilities by tomorrow. And the central government is planning to preemptively test some 160,000 people in the capital region. For the capital region, which is among the most affected areas, we're planning to conduct tests on everyone linked to nursing homes and related facilities. Other cluster infections around the country have come from gatherings from friends and family members. These outbreaks are likely to come from gatherings over the Chuseok Thanksgiving holiday. But concerns grow as they come following the relaxation of restrictions this week. Experts say protecting nursing homes is vital, with one of them suggesting regular preemptive testing at nursing homes is an option. Lee Young-un, Arirang News.